I came across this record today at an antique shop down in Buzzards Bay in Massachusetts where I hadn't been in, in quite a few years. And I just happened to find it in a stack of records. And uh, it's the uh, rear uh, single-sided uh, 10 and 3 quarter inch European Odeon label. And over on the back, it has uh, etched in the t in t into the back the uh, the trademark symbol of, of the Odeon label. Right there, if you can see it, along with the Odeon name. I had never come across one of these. And what makes it even better is that... Um, this is this re this is a recording by John McCormick, the the famous Irish tenor, who uh, signed a long-term contract with the Victor Talking Machine Company in 1910. But before he left Europe uh, for America in 1910, uh, he made a series of recording sessions from 1906 to 1909 on the Odeon label. And this is from one of his last sessions in September or October of 1909. So I'm going to play this for you now. It's called The Bay of Biscay, uh, Mr. John McCormick, tenor. And interestingly, he's etched his, his signature into the, um, uh, into the runout over here on this side. So let's put that on. The Bay of Biscay by uh, a man who, is be who, is be who would become known as the world's greatest lyric tenor, Mr. John McCormick. I'm going to play that on the Victor Three. One of his last Odeon recording sessions, uh, recorded in London in September or October of 1909. That's uh, a man who was to become known as the world's greatest lyric tenor, uh, Mr. John McCormick. 